Hi, and welcome to Digital Tech Reviews and Tips, guys. Today, I'm going to be unboxing the gold 32GB iPhone 5S. Now, the Apple iPhone 5S is the newest of all the iPhone models. The old one, the Apple iPhone 5, was discontinued and rebranded as the 5C, basically. Uh, slightly different, added color on the back and, you know, a little bit here and there. But basically the same thing. Now, the iPhone 5S has some cool features, namely the fingerprint sensing home button, which allows you to scan your fingerprint to get into the phone and to access different features. And also the camera on the back, which they added a bigger sensor and the True Tone LED flash. Now the 5S also comes loaded with iOS 7 and a bunch of other cool things that make it one of the leading smartphones on the market right now. So enough of the talk though, let's get right to it. Comes in a box, that's pretty standard. And it's a simple box, like if you've gotten any other Apple products, you're very familiar with them by now. You know, Apple logo on one side, iPhone 5S on two sides, Apple logo on two sides as well. On the back, bunch of stuff, barcodes, you know the deal. And on the front, you got the iPhone itself. So let's get right to opening it. Take off that plastic saran wrap or whatever it is, and you get right to the box. Open it up, and there it is. Sitting right on the top, look at that, just begging to be used. Okay, we'll, we'll take it out. And there it is, you can see the gold back. I'll set it aside for now. You're like, no, I wanna see it. Oh, too bad. <laughs> Let's get to this first. Here you got your instruction manual in there. You know, your regular stuff, stickers, you know, the instruction manual, your warranty, all that stuff. I don't really wanna have to open that. You guys know what's there. And here you got the new, or semi-new, they're about a year old, Apple iPhone and iPod Touch and iPad headphones that they send along. They're pretty cool. They're kind of comfortable. They're kind of cool. Old, different than the old ones that they had. I don't know. They're pretty stylish. Not the best. You're probably going to want to pick up some new ones. Anyways, here's the wall charger plug-in. You know, the, it has a USB adapter. So you can plug it right in and charge your iPhone from the wall. Very helpful. And they also, of course, have the new lightning cable. USB to lightning cable allows you to sync your iPhone to your computer or charge it using the wall charger or anything else really. So yeah, that's what comes in the box. And then we'll get to the iPhone itself. Now the iPhone is very thin and it's very, it really has some nice weight to it. I really like the metal band that they've kept this with the top model. That's one reason I don't like the iPhone 5C because it's really plasticky. But with the iPhone 5S, you get a nice metal edge to it, which makes it feel like really expensive and makes it feel like you're getting your money's worth at least. You know, that's always a good thing when you pay top dollar for these products. On the back, it is gold, if you can see that. And you're not colorblind. You can see that that is indeed, it's, it's an off gold. It's not like complete flashy, you know, bling gold, but it's definitely gold. You, know, you can see in the glint there. And then you've got the camera on the back with the True Tone LED flash that has like the yellow and white uh, LEDs. And yeah, that's about it guys. I can just do a quick comparison of it side by side to the Samsung S3. And you can see it's definitely thinner by, I don't know how much, maybe a couple millimeters. You know, not a lot, but it's definitely thinner. It is a little smaller. Apple still has not upped the screen size to match the Samsung's line or much of the other Android's line, but that is said to be coming with the iPhone 6. So hold your breath until then if you haven't bought the iPhone 5S and you really want the bigger screen, but if not, iPhone 5S is very cool. Slow-mo, you know, uh, tons of cool things, guys. Really, leave your questions down below if you have any questions about it. If you want me to review a certain feature, um, comment if you just wanna say cool video. Uh, like it, subscribe, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, those are where I'm on. You're on YouTube now in case you don't know. And that's about it guys, peace out and have a nice day.